Wow. <laughs> uh I meant to press jump. I accidentally pressed dodge. But I didn't die. <laughs> I don't think I could do that again if I tried. In fact, save that. Probably won't make much of a difference. Oh, I'm going all the way back. I mean, this, where, this was where the game was leading me, so... I'm hoping that this... Uh, I don't know. Like, I feel like I shouldn't have to go all the way down, so I think I actually did something wrong. But, yeah, it's weird. It feels like I shouldn't be going back, because there's still, isn't there, there's one more platform that I need to get. Oh, oh, oh no, wait, shit, no, oh, never mind. Okay, let's put the one platform that isn't open yet. I have to figure out how to get to those two areas. Wait. I wonder, can I jump to those? What if I do end up falling down? See, that would kill a person. Or at least break their legs. For some reason, they just didn't bother developing that. can jump to that. Ankh of Isis. This way. Let me see what's in this direction. Yeah, I think they were just leading me back. Because I can get these two. And then... Going in one of these directions... Actually, that looks like where I was supposed to come from. So... But this way does not look familiar, so I think I'm supposed to go this way. Jesus, I almost fell. Because I forgot to press Y. Whew. I think 
That's scripted. Uh, no, I have not the bison. Thank, thank you for asking first. <laughs> Some people don't have the pre-thinking to do that. Or the forethought to do that. So what do I actually have to do here? Yeah, this is the PC version. Which, uh, I do have the PS2 version, and I played it way back when, but I only got up to the first. I only played most of the first level. I saw the PC version like a few months ago for like $1.79, so I figured why not. But I don't know if the PS2 version has the same bugs that this version does, but this version is considerably buggy. Yeah, I'm using it, uh, which is one of the positive points of this game, too, is that I'm using an Xbox 360 controller, and surprisingly enough, this game detected it and has all of the buttons mapped to it. So the only downside is that any of the controls that show up, like press this button to do this, is typically done with PC controls. But I can, it's an old game, so it's a, I can be a little bit... I don't really judge it based on that. I'm actually wondering how to pull this off. I think what I do is... I jump onto that. Oops. I'm gonna die. Oh, I didn't even know. I actually thought that would one shot me, so I didn't know that that would just take a chunk of your health off, but this will most assuredly kill me. This opens up a door, so I kind of have to press it. At least I think it opened up a door. Why is she not grabbing for it? That's the second time that she didn't grab for that. There is enough distance, or it is short of enough of a distance for her to grab it, so I don't know why she isn't. Um, I don't know if they, like, re-released this for, like, it's still really cheap. I would wait for it to go on sale if your only option is PC. I, I don't know why she's not grabbing for that. She should be able to. I guess I'm just not supposed to go that way. That's what the game is telling me. It seems like I should be able to grab that, but for some reason I'm not. Especially since this platform pops out. Yeah, she's... I guess I'm just not meant to grab that thing. Like, it's just... If there is enough of a distance where I should be able to, but I think the game is just programmed for me not to be able to grab it. Because I know I have grabbed stuff from a distance like that before, so... 
The game's lying to me. That also doesn't work. Alright, so... That's definitely... Not going to work. After all of those attempts. So I have to find... Out what am, else am I supposed to do? I guess go down this way. Oh shit. Why did she jump to the right? I was pressing straight. See what I said about this She deserved that. Because now I have to do this all over again. Not not this whole puzzle, but getting to that point in the first place. S this is, without a doubt, the most frustrating save function I've ever seen in a video game. I guess this was before auto saves or quick, uh, not quick saves, because quick saves you still have to do yourself. But typically, video games nowadays, I'm, uh, I, I'm not even sure if I can hold this against this game because it was so old that it might be before an auto save function worked this way. But typically, when you get to a checkpoint, you can reload that save even though you didn't physically go into the menu and select save. But in order for you to reload from your last checkpoint, when you didn't die, you have to hit the save feature. So pretty much, every time there's a checkpoint, if you don't want to go back a considerable amount and do a lot of stuff over again, you have to save every single time there's a checkpoint. Back then, it would have been frustrating, but that was your best option, because no other video game thought of it at the time. Nowadays, it's incredibly frustrating, because you're used to it. So yeah, bear that in mind. If you really want to play this game, and you don't mind the fact that it has not aged very well, then yeah, buy it. But if a lot of these functions that you're used to in more modern games really grates on your nerves, you might not enjoy this game very much. And doing this shaves off time to going back the other way. Because you can just jump to each of the platforms. <sighs> oh my god, this is... Yeah, I... It's, a, it's really, really grating on my nerves that I have to keep repeating parts over and over and over. Because the save feature is an auto. Like, these are 10 and 20 minute chunks. This isn't like a minute that's shaved off. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, there is, <clears throat> there is no way I'm playing the game that's in my title. That's more of a joke than anything. 
I mean, people can if they want, but maybe they would probably want to do it every other shot or maybe every two shots because if they take a shot every time I fall to my death, they're probably going to die of alcohol poisoning. <clears throat> I got the other one right. Let me see my menu. Yeah, there it is. Okay, so I can walk over air. No, not load. Jesus Christ. It scared the shit out of me. Yeah, that's for chatters if they have the alcohol. And again, I don't think I would recommend taking this many shots. What the fuck are you doing, Lara? Down there. Okay, I know why that it was doing that. Again, it, it's wonky as hell. Because the little indicator telling you you can grapple onto that disappeared a couple of times. As I was jumping in the air. Oh yeah, this is also something that shouldn't have been intended. But you can outright kill these things if you're on a platform like this without getting hurt. And you don't have to waste ammo from uh, <clears throat> your 50 cals or your shotgun if you don't want to. You can just kill them the boring way. And the safer way. Because they're kind of dicks. I think, uh, yeah, I'm supposed to actually come down here. Uh, I have an MSI NVIDIA GTX 970, that's the name of it. I actually used to have an EVGA GTX 970, what was it, AVX 2.0 plus SSC, that was the full name. That one... It that one was either defective or it degraded really fast because my GPU crashes kept increasing and increasing. Actually, I'm not sure, but I think I may not have... I don't know if I have the full name of the graphics card in my profile or my description below, but... If I do, then I think I need to change that. Uh, they both have coil wine. In all honesty, I'm, I'm not sure if you can find a card that doesn't have it. This one's about as loud as my old one was. The plus side, no GPU crashes. It still runs really well, too. But I don't think it was because... Uh, EVGA develops effective products. I think that I was just unlucky.
because with technology, you're always going to run the risk of getting a, defo uh, a defective product. Because I've had it happen before. Shit. The problem is, is I didn't discover it until a year later, so I couldn't return it. Uh, and get my money back. Or get a replacement. I kind of just thought that, like, maybe it was something that happens on occasion. And that it'll go away after a while, and it did This one, however, has had, knock on wood, zero issues since I put this one in. Yeah, but uh, I did a little bit of extra. Actually, I bought another, before I got the MSI 970, I actually bought a graphics card before that developed a gigabyte that had three fans on it. The problem is, is that it was too big for my rig, so I had to send that one back. And it sucked too, because that one looked really cool. But that was my fault more than anything. Or, not more than anything, that was totally my fault. Because they gave you the uh, the measurement for the uh, card, and I just didn't measure it. I just did not pay attention to that at all. So, that was an error on my part. I think I'm supposed to go down here. Aren't I? Oh, yeah, I think this leads back. But is there another way that I can go? I feel like there's more to this than I'm seeing. The MSI is the best quality. Yeah, well, uh, <laughs> so far so good. I just hope they really are up to snuff. I mean, there shouldn't be any other problems. My, uh, my hard drive was actually showing bad sectors. I actually didn't realize that until I took it in for repair. They ended up finding out, so my hard drive is brand new. My power supply unit is an 850 watt, and it's only a few months old. So, everything except for the motherboard and the CPU are brand new in this thing. And the case, technically, too. And the fans. But, yeah, well, so, like, say about 60% of the computer is brand new parts. I think I was going to like put liquid cooling in this too, but I'm going to do that on my next build. Welcome back, Miss Mel. I feel like there should be something that I'm seeing that I'm not. Like this doesn't feel like this is the last part of this platforming. Or this platform puzzle. But I guess it is. Because there's... There's stuff up there, but... Like, I can't get to it. So I guess I gotta go back down.
Wait. Why did they start me off there? Oh! I didn't go this way before. God, how do you even do that puzzle? Oh, this just leads back this way. Okay. Alright, that's how you're supposed to do that. And that's the last platform. Thank the Lord. Was starting to wear thin. Aw, oh, man, and this it doesn't open, so I have to go back and do that damn jumping puzzle over again. Why, Lara? Why? When I wasn't pressing that direction, did you just decide he wanted to face that direction? It makes no sense. It never will make any sense. It just is. Of course it's going to be harder going back. Ah, oh, fuck you, you fucking jumping puzzle. Alright, now I know what I have to do. That one way I was going, I have to... Go back that way. Which sucks, because it's a real pain in the ass. Just in case. I still feel like there's I should there's something else that I should be doing here.
Why does it start you all the way down here? This is a stupid ass checkpoint. Yeah, it's just secrets. There's it, it's probably a relic for that one. Ah, fuck you. Stupid blade. I know, th this was a very poorly placed checkpoint, because you have to do this entire part over again. Probably something to that that I'm just not seeing. Not that this matters. No! What the fuck, Lara? Jesus fucking Christ! I wasn't telling you to jump up. I was telling you to jump to the left. Why the fuck these controls are so fucking wonky, I do not have a clue. I was pressing left. There should have been no confusion there. And there was. Yeah, I know you have to jump backwards, I just don't know where you're supposed to jump backwards. And, in all honesty, it's probably just for a relic that I really don't care about. So... I'm just moving on. You can dive. I just never figured it out. It doesn't take away your health if you just do a cannonball, so... One of the. Alright, that leads back up. I wanted these, but that works too.
So it's that boss that I was fighting earlier, but it doesn't have armor. In the, uh, the last level. I like how they couldn't be bothered to animate her actually putting in objects instead of just turning them. It actually went by a little faster than I thought it would. I actually thought that second part of this level was going to take the rest of the night. See? They're buggy as shit. But if you're on the stairs, that does, that will never work. Bullet time thing. I don't know why that didn't work there either. I mean, I have plenty of health, but specifically not enemies that cause me to die. Okay, I get it. Oh, this is going to take a little while. Because one affects the other. Those two are fine. These two are not, though. Probably going to do this through sheer dumb luck.
It seems like when I turn one, it affects them all. Or, to, or at least it affects the two on the side. Yeah, it, uh, it affects the two that are next to it, but it doesn't affect the one across the room. God, I hate puzzles like this. <laughs> well, uh, welcome, Parab. Sorry, I was concentrating a little on, uh, getting this puzzle done, and well, let's just say it's not going that well. Still saving a game in Echoes of Darkness, about three hours, gameplay in, falling to my death, enter game, falling to death, reload, enter game, falling to death. I did not even know that that... Uh, what game is that, actually? Echoes of Darkness, is that a... that's not a Tomb Raider game, is it? Because I actually haven't heard a game like that. That was trial and error. Literally trial and error. And on the off chance I do something stupid again and I want to reload. Actually, you know what? Just in case this save feature is even wonkier than I think it is. Alright, I was way back during the PS2 age. Again, just in case. Save since we hit a new checkpoint. I didn't press backwards, I pressed left! Why did Lara jump backwards? That was bullshit, too. It literally caught my... barely my foot. wish the camera wouldn't move so that I can jump like I'm supposed to.
I'm pressing left! Why is she jumping up? And Laura just listen to me for once. I'm pressing left on the analog stick. It is all the way over left. It is not going northwest. It is not. It is not going southwest. I am pressing it all the way to the left, and Lara is jumping up. That makes no sense at all whatsoever. And if you do it that way, she's a huge dipshit and just jumps right to her death. So you have to do it the way the game is telling you. The problem is, is that Lara doesn't agree. Except the one point where the game proves me wrong. No, it doesn't. You know why? Because I didn't do anything different there, and all of a sudden she just decided that she wanted to jump the way I was telling her to. Fuck that noise. I don't ever want to deal with that again. Too far. I hope the the reboot is not as bullshitty as this game is. I want to have fun with that game. I don't want to yell at it. I mean, I know I, I know it has QTEs and shit, but hopefully they're not as bad as like Resident Evil 4 is. That's all I add. If they would have spent a little more time fine-tuning the platforming, this game would be much, much better. Derped my pen. Yeah. It's just one of those moments. was never a point where I was pressing down. And Lara just went down. For no reason. No logic. Only madness. Your will is no longer your own. I thank... Uh, most likely that's power up. Uh, excuse me if that's not. But thank you for following. I have the preview disabled so I won't see it until it shows up in the website. Yep, that is. Thank you, power up, for following. Okay, I don't know where to go from here. I feel like I should know.
Oh, up here. All right. There we go. Dragon? There be dragons in here. I don't know which way I should go. I don't think there was a checkpoint recently, but just in case. Oops. Alright, man, that didn't accomplish anything. I have a feeling... Oh, it is gonna... Alright. There's the Uzis. So they call them dual mini SMGs. Can I get back that way? Or do I have to fall? Well, do you do cosplay at all? Because I am quite a fan of people who can do good cosplays. There was someone that was actually a big enough fan of Deathwing that did a really cool cosplay of him. I think he's the only one that's actually attempted it. Oh, okay. I mean, there's easy ones to do. Like, uh, ones from, like, video games that take place in real life. Like, uh... Heather Morris from Silent Hill 3... She was popular at one point. Oddly enough, I've only seen one... Uh, I've seen quite a few people who've cosplayed Max from Life is Strange, but I've only seen one person actually do Chloe. I'm a little surprised by that. I thought she'd be the fan favorite. But they just wear regular clothes, so they would actually be pretty easy to emulate. The shirt would probably be the hardest part. Okay, I don't really know where to go next. I think maybe... No, well, no, there's nowhere that I could grapple onto. This is where I came from. Wasn't it? Yeah. So I don't go back. Oh, <laughs> I was talking from Life is Strange. 
not a... Uh, although, she, uh, I didn't even know there was a Chloe from Uncharted. I only played the first... I only played the first Uncharted, and um, I didn't beat it because my PS3's hard drive died. For, yeah, no, the motherboard died. So I lost all my stuff on it. No. No. Okay, the signs don't go in there. I need to find two aunts. I do have the Uncharted collection, though, for PS4. So I, I am going to play those eventually. I'll probably get to them after I move. Because then I'll have a better setup. And after I get the Uncharted, after I finish the Uncharted collection, I'll, I don't have Uncharted 4, but I'll buy that eventually and play it. I feel like I missed something. I'm pretty sure I missed something. That's not for a while, though. I know it'll have to be straight to the PS4, because I can't figure out how to get my capture card to, to run without, uh... Without the audio desync. I missed these. I never played Bounty Hunter, I don't think. <sighs> Better than dying, at least. Uh, don't let me sway you from not buying the Witness, but... Um... Let's just say... I know everything about that game, and there is no way in hell I am playing that. Maybe you'll think differently, like I said. Make your own judgment. Oh, okay. Yeah, um... I'm not the biggest Star Wars fan, so there's like only a few Star Wars games that I actually bothered to play. I had, um, what was it? I never played Battlefront. I could never... I had a demo of Battlefront, and the demo wasn't very good. People actually told me that the game itself was a lot more fun. Than the, de than the demo made it out to be. So... Hmm. Is there another one of those that I'm not seeing? Like, it's also a little odd that this is here. Oh, God. I don't know about the gameplay. Uh, it's more the story, more than anything. It's 
kind of the developer, too, that I have a particular problem with. Like, I don't really judge a game based solely on the developer. But it's complicated. <laughs> like, a developer could be a complete piece of shit and still make a really good game. I have a feeling that I'm just missing something. That there's another one of those that I'm just not seeing. This was backwards, right? I oh, know, this is a new way. Okay. This is what I missed. Got about a half hour left. I did not intend to move that fast. <laughs> I, uh... That, like, really, uh... That actually scared the shit out of me. Timed puzzle. Or is it? Maybe I think I might have to do something down there and then I press the switch again. Let me look at it one more time just in case. I want to see exactly what it does. Yeah, that cutscene plays, so that's leading me to believe that I have to do something down there first. Whatever it shines on. Yeah, I have to bring those four pillars up. Okay. Oh, there's another ladder there. surprised there's an artifact here. This is an intended path. I really hope that I just can't hook onto that. It's not bugged. There we go. It's one. Yeah, 
I can't grab onto that. I have a strange feeling there's a reason why they put this here. Oh, wait a sec. Uh, maybe there's something else I have to do. <laughs> Lara, why would you overshoot it like that? At least I didn't die. Oh, no, wait. Never mind. I don't think that would have done anything anyway. So that brings it back up. So why would I do that? I'm guessing it's... If... You hit one of them and you're not supposed to. Oh man, I have to do it all over again. God damn it. Uh, I can't jump up. How am I supposed to get out of here? I didn't bug it, did I? Oh, that's why. Okay. Now I know why they... I knew there was a reason. There had to be. Laura, why the hell are you jumping like that? That one I'll have to do over again. bring it down, I have to jump up really fast, and I go to the right. <laughs> yeah, gee, I wonder why. No! I said, wonky ass controls. I pressed right and she jumped up. She did it again! Why she keeps doing that, I don't know, but it's pissing me the fuck off. I have a feeling I'm not doing this right. Maybe I'm supposed to bring it entirely down, jump back onto that, which I can jump... Well, no, that wouldn't make any sense, though. Hold on. Go all the way up, so I bring this all the way down.
So that locks. Alright. So I think that's why I had to do that. Uh, hi, uh, hi, Joel. Yeah, yeah, there's still some time left before I have to leave. So that was probably why it felt wonky, because the game was telling me you can't jump that way. Which kind of sucks, because it seems like I could grab for that. I can't. Oh, uh, you know what? I think I had to do that. Wait. Okay, she didn't grab for it for some reason. So I gotta do this all over again. She can't grab for that, even though it looks like it. I feel like she should be able to grab for that. I don't see where else I could go otherwise. I do from here. Oh god damn it. This is getting really it feels this is feeling really tedious. Or maybe I had to do this, I don't know. Cause this is where I wanted to get in the first place. Stumped. I don't know what to do next. Because I can't get back over there. Just can't grab onto that. Can't jump to that. Hmm. I wonder if I hook that and I 
I start bringing that up, I can jump over and get that one. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. That one's okay. I don't think I have to mess with that one anymore. But I think I have to hook this, quickly get over there to get on the platform, to get onto that, so that I can jump to that, bring that one down, um, and I can jump on that, um, I think. Because I have to bring that all the way down in order for it to set properly. Otherwise, it'll just start going back up. So I have to bring that down, but where, then where do I go from there? Maybe this will be out far enough where I can do something with this. Alright, so... No, Lara, why are you jumping? Oh my god. Wonky ass controls. So now I gotta do this one over again. I think I have to I have to get over there fast enough where I can get onto that platform because if I can't grab onto that fast enough, I'm not gonna be able to jump over there. This is gonna be such a time. I'm an idiot. I'm a fucking idiot. No, the pillar thing, I don't think you can. I see no reason to. Good night, Parov. Thank you again for following. Uh, and I'm thank you for not minding the fact that I get very vocal when I get frustrated. <laughs> that might have been me and my dumbass over there. I was actually a little flabbergasted that she grabbed onto that too, because I could have sworn that she wasn't going to. The one time I needed her to grab onto that. The one time, and she just doesn't. She just doesn't. She doesn't listen. This has to be down. I think. Oh, it can't be down. Wait, why is this... 
shouldn't this be going down because I'm on it? I actually don't get that. It's a little odd, to say the least. There. Actually, I think bringing that back up was a mistake. So I think I actually have to bring that down. <clears throat> I think once I get this puzzle done, uh, I'll be done for the night. So that was the second one. Uh, I have to go that way. Bring that one all the way down. And then I'll bring this one down. I just hope I can do that without being stuck down here. I still don't understand why this one's not coming down anymore. I think I glitched it. I don't know how, but I did. As it should be going down, but for some reason it's not. I definitely have the strange feeling that I I broke it. I don't know how I did it, but I did. Because this should be coming down when I'm on it, and for some reason it's not. I still don't understand why she throws herself like that. And that makes no sense. Yeah, it, if... If it turns out that I broke this puzzle, then I'm done for the night. Because I have to go to work soon anyway. Three of them are down. That one's not moving. I can't even do that. There's nothing I can do that can get that to move. That wasn't right.
There we go, now it's moving. I don't even know how I managed to do that. <laughs> I was still pushed in like that. That was... Okay. I have to figure out how to get up. Oh, wait. I'm an idiot. I have to jump back. Next checkpoint I get to, I'll save. Which I think is going to be after here. Or not. So what do I do now? Oh wait, no, I can go back up this way, that's right. Um... Okay, I didn't expect that to happen. I don't, uh, I don't think that there's anything particularly special. Like, I don't think I have to pull down all four. I think it just does that to add difficulty, I guess. Well, I'll see when I get back up there. Because I don't know if it reset or not. Oh yeah, it did. So yeah, I think I just have to jump immediately. And she'll grab onto this. There we go. Yeah, that was a little frustrating, but I actually did kind of like that puzzle. I glitched it out, too. I don't think that one not moving was supposed to be intended. This music means I did a good job. Oh. Hold on. I can't go back down that way. Um, yeah, I really need to stop. So, I'm gonna stop here. This could be the end of the level for all I know. Uh, oh no, wait, no, it isn't yet. Because I still have to get the two onks for that one statue. And I think this is... I think I'm going to the first one. So I have one more puzzle after this. But uh, I'm all done for the night. I have to get a shower, get ready for work, and do a few other things. Ugh. But uh, I'll...